Hey, Michael Church, Crawl Space Ninja, Basement Ninja, and I uh, just want to share with you some benefits of crawl space encapsulation. So if you're on the fence about whether to encapsulate your crawl space or not, stay tuned. The wonders of life. Okay, so I've done a little bit of research on this topic, and depending on uh, how you're approaching your crawl space encapsulation project, I wanted to share with you a few different takes on this. So, number one, uh, if for some reason you're considering selling your home, there's a lot of positive research out there on the internet that says uh, a, a crawl space that is encapsulated actually will add to the resale value of the home. Now, of course, uh, that's always uh, up for debate. Uh, like I've always heard, you can only sell something for what somebody's willing to give you for it. But let me talk about it another way. If it doesn't add value to the home, uh, in my opinion, it should certainly uh, keep the value of the home. So in other words, we get a lot of calls from real estate transactions and they're having issues with the crawl space. And of course the homeowner's like, I didn't know it was that bad. And then uh, the home inspector goes down there and it's disgusting. And so of course the buyer wants a deal and the seller wants to do it cheap. Uh, and it, it could even cost the sale of the house. If you've got somebody that's concerned about mold or structural issues or things like that, uh, just like I mentioned on a video a few days ago, how um, uh, the basement waterproofing wasn't done uh, correctly and it, it caused me and my family to walk away from the house. So if you've got a crawl space that's in dire need of encapsulation, uh, you could either lose money on the house or lose the deal completely. Okay, so uh, if you encapsulate the crawl space, another benefit is that it will improve indoor air quality. Now it does this several different ways, all right? Uh, depending on what, how you wanna look at this. Okay, so indoor air quality, dust mites are affected by humidity. Okay, so if you've got a humid crawl space, humid basement, humid home, uh, your dust mite population is going to be larger and the dust mites are huge allergens, especially among kids. Uh, so anyway, that's one way it's going to improve indoor air quality. If you have a less humid crawl space, you're gonna have less mold and less wood rot fungus in the crawl space, which is also a problem for indoor air quality. Uh, if you encapsulate the crawl space properly with ventilation, Added to that, it will control radon and soil gases, which can also affect indoor air quality. Uh, so uh, encapsulation of the crawl space, in, in our opinion, is, uh, is to control or improve indoor air quality. That should be the number one reason why anybody should consider investing in a crawl space encapsulation system. Okay, so on top of controlling humidity, uh, there's a lot of research out there by the Department of Energy. Even April Air has, has shown research that uh, the, uh, the home feels more comfortable with controlled humidity as well as makes the heating and air unit, especially the, the uh, air conditioning side, uh, work less uh, hard in order to lower the temperature of the house. So the more humidity that's in the air, the more humidity the, the HVAC system has to remove in order to lower the temperature of the conditioned air. So if you've got a low humidity environment, your home should be more comfortable and should save you energy because your AC unit is not having to work as hard to get the temperature down to what you desire. And of course, if you're controlling humidity, uh, you're also controlling wood rot fungus, right? Or preventing wood rot fungus, which could destroy the structure or the foundation of the home. Uh, there was a video, and I'll put a link to it down below. It was a soda blasting job that we did where it showed all of this caked on nasty uh, wood rot fungus. It was yellow and all that, and when we soda blasted it all off, the, the integrity of the wood was certainly uh, uh, affected, okay? So now we're gonna have to go in and sister wood, uh, sister Joyce, and put in uh, jacks and, and you know, subfloor supports and different things like that. And the house was less than 10 years old. So humidity has a huge effect on mold, wood rot fungus, uh, uh, dust mites, indoor allergens, as well as comfort. Okay, another benefit that we see by encapsulating the crawl space is your 
uh, going to be more comfortable uh, just because the space will be conditioned in most cases uh, by the heating and air unit ductwork being going through the crawl space. But uh, the other thing that's going to happen is you should notice that your pipes are less likely to freeze in a conditioned space. Uh, so it's, it's basically uh, keeping all that cold air out in the wintertime and as long as the temperature is kept above freezing in the crawl space, you're not going to have pipes freezing and different things like that. So that's a, another added benefit of crawl space encapsulation versus an open crawl space where if it's 12 degrees outside, that 12 degree air is blowing into the vents of the crawl space and then you've got your, you can still keep the pipes from freezing by having them wrapped and even putting a, a heated strap on the pipes and things like that. But certainly encapsulation eliminates that worry of uh, freezing pipes. And of course, uh, the other benefit would be if you have a standing water or a flooding issue, if you encapsulate it properly with a French drain and sump pumps and different things like that, you're not gonna have a flooding problem which is going to add to a humidity problem, which is going to add to an indoor air quality problem. So these are all things that can be eliminated by crawl space encapsulation. And if you can think of a benefit that you received by encapsulating your crawl space, please put it down below. I, I'm sure there's other benefits that maybe I, I don't know about or haven't come across. But anyway, just uh, uh, comment down below if you've come across some crawl space encapsulation benefits of your own that I didn't mention. And uh, my name is Michael Church with Crawl Space Ninja and Basement Ninja. We appreciate you watching this video and hope you make it a happy and blessed day. We'll see you later. Pretty inside for everyone to enjoy. Standing up close by the Christmas tree. Glimmering light, I am right where I want to be. I will be home for a couple of days. Wander around with you.